How you doing? I'm going to show you these two charges right here. Now for each battery, they have, let me get the flashlight over here, small little tab right here on this side. See right there, on the black injector, the tab is on the other side. Now what I'm going to show you is how to get rid of those tabs real easy. Void your warranty on the charger, but then you can use any um, Black & Decker, Stanley, or Porta Cable battery on them. If you have one charger, and then you can use that one charger on all of them. Maybe even DeWalt, I'm not sure. Please leave it in the comment if you know. If a DeWalt can be fitted with a, say, Black & Decker drill. If so, then this should work with the DeWalt, not 100% sure. But, it takes a 45 security bit. Come on, focus. Try that again. One with a hole in there. And I'll get them open and show you. Now, it's just four screws on the back, one here, 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 and here. And the screws right here. And it just pops right open. And you will see the tab you need to cut off is right there. You don't have to take out any electronics, anything like that. And I'll get the Black & Decker open. I'll just do that on camera. How about that? Took less time than I thought. But yeah, you have to use the security type bit. Or else you probably will strip the outer part of the screw. Because a regular Torx won't go all the way in. And then if you don't have a security screw, then you're screwed because you can't take it apart or put it back together without it. Okay. Now the Black & Decker, same exact thing. And we pan over. Same exact thing underneath. Except the Black & Decker, the tab is on that side. Put them together. Tabs on opposite side. Okay. Let me cut these off. We'll test them out. All right. <clears throat> well, here on the left is the Stanley. On the right is the Black & Decker. Let's get that focused in better here. Yeah. Doesn't take much to cut off that tab. So, put them back together. And, uh... Test them out. All right, here we are. <clears throat> They're plugged in. Here is an unmodified Black & Decker battery. There's no notch there. And an unmodified Stanley battery. There's no notch there. Now the Stanley battery on the Black & Decker. And the Black & Decker on the Stanley. They work. Black & Decker is already charged, so... The light's already steady. Stanley needed a little bit, <clears throat> but they do work. So that's a way to modify your charger so it'll work on an unmodified battery if you want if you don't want to modify your batteries. So thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and all that jazz.